He's not going. He's not going. Where is this guy? This is number five. Where's number six? Your father, the late king, killed a man and took a deal that belonged to the two of them. That was why he died an unnatural death and you cursed with epilepsy that comes once in a while. This said man had two children, a girl and a boy. Their names are Amaka and Chin also, popularly known as Fast. Fast has always plotted to kill your wife on your wedding day. But your uncle has always beat him to it. What? What am I supposed to do? For I have just one week to present a bride to my people. That is why you have to hurry home, my king. For very important visitors await you. And who are these visitors? The visitors are Amaka and Chinonso. You don't have to be scared, my king. For the gods have ordained that Amaka will be your queen. She has the healing power that when you meet her as your wife, after your marriage, the epilepsy will be gone from you and it will be gone forever. My in-laws, you people have done well. Yes, eh? I'm happy. At this point, I hand you over to my brother to do the needful. Come to Apuzi and come from Namo. Okay, they will. They are done. But I'm done. Why? Bring my daughter. Hmm. Go out. Hey, I don't you come. Come, my daughter. Today is that great and expected day. Hmm? <laughs> uh, <Adabeke. laughs> I want you to show me that man that has so stolen your heart that you no longer even concentrate on it. <laughs> the basic <laughs> things. Eh? <laughs> this. Let me know who he is. Thank you. Yeah? Uh -huh. <laughs> Ijere nwa Ewo Nuku ijere Shall be well with you. 
say. You shall have all the children you deserve. You say. The type of children that will represent you properly everywhere. You say. That with which you will train your children shall not be lacking in your house. You, say. you shall go and come in peacefully. Your children at the end of the day shall take care of you. Okay, don't man a key. Don't man a key. Don't man a key. Don't man a key. My people, I greet you all. <laughs> Today is indeed a very wonderful day. Ah, uh, we thank the gods for giving us the opportunity to witness this historical day. And so without wasting much of your time, I would like... No, I know, see. His wound. With time, he will forget about all these things and move on. Oh, okay, now. Mama, how do I look him in the eyes and tell him all this? How? You don't need to look into his eyes. Huh? Oh. You don't need to look into his eyes now. You let him hear me. Okay, she look at his head. You are not even seeing any part of his body. It is no longer in your place. To look at any part of his body. You mean I should now, when I'm telling him, I should back him? Is that the best way? Look. The prince was here earlier. Oh. Eh? He was here professing love for you. You can practically feel love in his utterance. Hey, Jim. that young man loves you. That man, that young man loves you. Do you know he knelt down and was crying? Mm -hmm. Has Richard ever knelt, uh, cried for you before? Ha. Mama, plenty of times now. That one is normal too. Mama, stop. Or cry is cry. A poor man he is always crying. Him. Madam, when a rich man cries, it means he's deeply in love. Yotago. So, if you say yes to the prince now, Hmm? Before you know it, we'll just boom to your father's village. And you know Richard does not know the place. And before you say Jack, ring in your finger, you have become the queen of that kingdom. Don't you want to be the queen? Hmm. Think about it take a wise decision that will benefit you, me, your father, and even save Richard's life. Why must my be different? Why must my own be different? Am I the only person Ruth, so for two weeks you can live your life without me. You have not seen me. You have not heard from me. And you're fine. Where are you? Richard! What is it? Richard! Uh, what is it? The worst has happened. What? What is it? The worst has happened, Richard. Calm down now. What is it? What happened? What, what happened? Richard, I warned you about this same girl, Ruth. But you won't listen Is she me. okay? Is she okay? I have not seen her. I have not heard from her. From no, her. it's not okay. okay. I hope nothing happened No, to see, see, evidence, evidence, evidence. Did anything happen? Richard, hmm? you didn't listen to me. The same thing I talked about. Ruth, God will punish you and your people. It will never be well with you. Yes, my brother. After everything you did. Yes, this is Ruth. Who, who's, who sent this to you? Ah, it's Uzoma, our colleague. Who went to the village? He met it. Ah, 
It's not Ruth. Wait, slow down. Who, who sent this to you? Uzoma, our colleague, went to the village to go and inspect a project. He met Ruth and that prince Marines. Ah! Ah! He now took pictures. How do you believe it if it was just say Ruth Mary? No. Ruth, God will punish you and your people. Richard, everything, our land is gone. Our phone is gone. Everything is gone. Everything. Hey! Ruth, you are a wicked girl. Hey, Richard. My bro hey, hey. After all I lost because of her, hoping that one day. Richard, Richard, hey. What, what? Ruth, God will punish you. God will punish you and your parents. Hey! Hey, 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 hey. Richard, give me. Give me five. Give me five. Hey, Richard, Richard, please, give me five. 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 Give me! Ruth, God will punish you for all you did to my friend and my daughter. I lost all I have. Ruth, please kill me. Give me life! Give me life! Ruth, God will punish you. It will never be worth with you and your people. Hey! Richard! Bian woke him. When that boy was busy moving up and down, I advise you that you should send the assassin to finish him or we go to the palace with the youths and take power by force. And he told me you are practicing the art of war. See where the art of war has landed both of Don't them. not just calm down. Calm down. Let me think straight. Please. My friend, I'm not coming any down. They are not a couple. And the next meeting is a day for them to fix their own coronation. I've lost my chance of being the Olu, and you are telling me to calm down. What do you mean by that? No, not to calm down. I said I won't calm, calm down. down. I've lost everything. Can't calm down, my dear. What do you mean? Don't let us if you don't calm down, I'll walk you out of my house. What's the meaning of this? Allow me to clear my head so that I can think straight. Roland, I think I can lose this battle to you. You're joking. Fight this war to finish. By the powers vested on me as the Onu of this great kingdom, I. In my yard, if you ah. fight, I will cut you into two. What? Drop it. Drop it. Get off. Get off. Richard. No man, how dare you interrupt this trouble? Listen, my elders, I've not come here to cause trouble. Eh? I've come to take my woman. Okay. If, if I may ask, where is your wife? Richard, Richard, you have to go. You have to leave now. Uh, yes. yes. You had her, right? She belongs to him. She said she belongs to me, so get out of here. <laughs>
I must arrest that animal. Surely, I must arrest him for messing up my coronation and for the embarrassment he caused me. My Lord, my Lord, please forgive me. He is like a wounded lion trying to find his way home. He, he, he will get over me. Please. No. If I free that young man, he might come back again, again and again, and I wouldn't know what next he will do. My Lord, this is a man who lost his mother trying to save me. He gave his kidney to save me. Put yourself in his shoes. Consider his condition. This man has been through a lot because of me. Nobody will take it lightly. My Lord, please can you give me time? Let me have a word with him. Let me talk to him. I beg you. Please. Please. I will spare him. Just because of you. But when next he tries this, trust me. I will do what he will have to regret. Let me just talk to him. Please. Uh, oh no, I am on my way to attend a very important meeting. I, I will stop over in your house on my way back. I think we need to reschedule the date. All right then. What is the meaning of this? Go and clear up that room. You took my woman from me and I want her back. Your woman? Mm -hmm. Listen and listen real good. I married her officially. So I don't know what you're talking about. So get out of my way. Let me go for an important meeting. Okay, let's Tell listen to me. I have nothing more to lose in life. Ruth is my only source of joy. We are going to send her back to me. Failure to do so, I am going to kill you in your pride. And nothing will happen. You have two days to send her back to me. Two days. Else? Silas, get up. As I'm concerned, I have done everything I can. 
Guy, I have done everything that I can and it is still not working. What other choice do I have? I have to do what I have to do. I have heard enough of this shit. I have never been embarrassed like this all my life. Maybe I was taken for granted. It is time to praise the last button. Which is plan C. Execute Plan C immediately. Yes. Thank you. The quietness of a lion does not mean cowardice. I think I have been lenient for a roughly long time now. I have to take the bull by the horn. This plan C is my last card on the table. Make me proud. This Richard is gradually becoming a thorn on my flesh and I've been sparing him because of my wife. Because of him and the fear of the unknown, I am yet to be crowned a king. Do I lock him up for just a day and get crowned, after which I will release him? But what happens after the release? What is it? Your Highness, some gunmen just kidnapped your wife. What? Richard, you have finally stepped on the lion's tail, and I will fight you. I will stop at nothing in fighting you this time. Lighter. He has done his worst. You have to go and bundle that idiot to my palace right now. Good. That serves him right for taking the prince for granted. But uh, my spirit tells me that the boy is innocent of the accusation, as he says. Even if he is, he had threatened the prince severally on previous occasions. Even made physical 
contact on him. So whatever he is saying of being innocent is a jamboree. Well, uh, I believe that the threats were out of uh, frustration. Hmm? His story, if you listen to it, is indeed touching. Hmm. Yes, I just hey. wish that there's something I can do for that boy. <laughs> Honestly. Do you know as we speak now, the queen cannot calm the prince down until the wife returns back to him safe and sound, hair and heavy. Period. May the wills of the gods be done. I hope so. I hope so. Oh, yes, you know, sir. Your Highness, please, I beg in the name of whatever you hold dear to your heart, to kindly release my friend. Please help us. Please. You're asking me to release a kidnapper. Hmm? You're asking me to release a hardened criminal. A man who pointed a gun at me on several occasions. That is the man you're asking me to release. You're asking me to release a man who stopped my coronation. You're asking me to release a man who kidnapped my wife. Hey, young man, it doesn't work that way. Your Highness, Your Highness, Your Highness, please, please. I know Richard, my friend, can't be anything. Most certainly not the hardy criminal and the kidnapper, Your Highness, please. Are you calling me a liar? You no, 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 Your Highness. No, 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 no. Your Highness, I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is Richard made those threats out of anger and frustration. Any man in his shoe will have just saved. Or oh, if he was, please, just consider him. He's just a poor boy, he has nothing. Please, please, your Highness. It's only a foolish man that will act cowardly. When you fight a blue blood, you're fighting the entire kingdom. Tell your friend to advise his goons to release my wife. Else, I will kill him. And nothing will happen. Your Highness, I know Richard is a coward. Silas. Richard is a coward, Your Highness. Your Highness. Give me your hand, give me here, you give me here. You give me to your hand. Leave me, leave me. Your hand. Your hand, don't do this, please. Hey, Richard. Young man. Since you were locked up in the palace dungeon, you've been pleading not guilty, despite the beauty. I want to ask you for the last time, did you kidnap the queen or not? I'm innocent. Finally, to prove your innocence, Wash your hand in that water. Take the arm and touch your forehead three times. Eat one of the cola not there. If you are guilty, it's going to strike you down immediately. is innocent. You can leave. Oh no. Can 
Majesty. I hope this is potent enough. I cannot doubt the potency of uh, Igurube. It is the most legal way of interrogation. No. If I finally find out that what you did was a plan to free this young man, I will personally deal with you. By the powers vested on me as the Ono of this kingdom, I hereby crown you the king of our great kingdom. It shall be well with you. Long live the king! <laughs> of the great army. You rarely see a location like this. To what do we own this location? The prince offended a young man by name Richard. Richard, as an orphan, reported the matter to Arnie. For the prince to regain his sight, he needs to pay a visit to Richard and plead for forgiveness. If he goes to the young man to apologize to him, mm. the young man will demand that his girlfriend be given back to him. But both of us know that the prince will not ever allow that. The then winner. he will have to step down. Mm. He has to step down. Of course. Yes, because he cannot have them both at the same time. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? Yes. I pity Roland. <laughs> I pity him, honestly. Mm? I pity him. No. Things are falling in place. Yes. This is actually what we have strategized. Mm -hmm. So it's in our favor. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Let the ball keep rolling. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we are watching. Yeah. Let it keep rolling. Yeah. <laughs> This is royal affliction. Who 
pieces for just egg. I've seen image of the spirit. Opposite what I need with more. What is happening? I saw. What are you all doing here? Richard. Please. We came to ask for your forgiveness. For everything we put you through. Please forgive us. Please. Yes. You're sorry. Yes. I want your husband to know how it feels to lose everything. My son, we know that no amount of apology can fix the pain we have caused you. But please swallow the hard pill and let it all go. Uh, uh, my king here is ready to give you whatever, I mean, whatever you want for you to undo what you did. For him to regain his sight. Please, that is our humble request. Your king is willing to give whatever it is that I ask. Oh, yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes I, I am ready. ready. I, I, anything you ask of, I, I, I will give it to you here and now. I want my kidney back. <laughs> what? Have, Have you lost, lost it or what? Huh? Tell Ruth to give it back. I want my kid back. Richard, that is like you saying you want me dead. Yes. You should die. Ah. That's what love is about. It's about sacrifice. The kind I made for you. But better still, he has a kidney, right? He should give you his so that you can leave for him. Richard, this is insane. This not, it does not make any sense. Your time here is up. Get out. My son, Biko, don't do that. Yeah? Get out of this place. Please. Consider. My Beg him. 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 Mother be be just you know who. Dala. You think you cannot do this hurt? Why must my hope be different? Dala. Am I the only poor person in this whole world? Somebody answer me. Excuse me. What is that lady talking about? Wait. The director did just demanded that we return the kidney he donated to my daughter. Hey! I've always known that that wretched cost gorilla wekwensu, ekwensu no, and up to no good. Mama, uh, Mama, just stop. Stop. Please. I know you won't let me talk. No, uh, your, your Majesty. At this point, what shall we do? Uh, my in-law, I'd rather remember lying for the rest of my life than to allow my wife to die. My king, have you forgotten that this kingdom cannot be ruled by a blind man? In the next seven days, the people will start clamoring. Then oh no, who look for a great beer that can do undo. Eh? I am ready to pay the bill. Any amount of money that will cost me, I will pay. Look for a great beer for me. Hey, my king, I'm very sorry about this. But remember, Annie sent his servant. And uh, there's no other solution than to do what an servant pronounced. 
That's the only solution. We just have to go ahead and do it. Try to understand my cake. Richie, it is time you let go of this fruitless battle. I understand how you feel, or I try to understand how you feel. You know, the sacrifice, the pain, the love, and all that you have endured just for love. What do you get in return? Joy this minute, the sorrow come knocking in the night. Peace. I can't. I don't think I can forgive them. I want them to feel the pain. I cannot. My brother, once I was angry at you, but Mama on her dying bed told me that forgiveness is a virtue. I've since taken a great lesson out of that. Even if you take back your kidney, you can't have her back because she'll be dead. And the you that I know wouldn't want to see Ruth die. Look at all of this put together. And maybe again, the both of you were not meant to be together in real life. My people, I greet you all. Huh? Yeah. Is it welcome? I got the lion, I'm. Is it? I thank the gods of the land for a day like this. Hmm? Also, dear Marco, my beautiful wife. <laughs> uh, most especially, I thank um, Annie for touching the heart of Richard, making him to forgive me. Hmm? I personally called him. I asked him to come to this place today. I don't know why he's not here till now. Now, however, that will not stop us from toasting. It's a very special day. Okay, and the yeah, one. Yeah. Hey! hey. Yeah. No, no, no. What are you doing with the gun? Hey! hey! Richard, stop, stop! Richard, what are you doing? Richard, this is not And I can forgive. But I will not forgive. No, with the gun! Richard! Richard! What did you say? Hey! Okay. Ah! Hey! Richard, what are you saying? Stop! 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 Stop it! Stop! Please, please, please Richard, please, 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 this is not the solution. This is not the solution. Hey! 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 You think that I'll forgive? Richard, please, 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 Richard, this is not the answer, this is not the way. Richard, please, please, stop, stop. Stop, 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 You took my joy. You took the one thing that mattered most to me. And now you're sorry. Be gone! Be gone! Hey, 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 hey! Don't, 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 don't. I am 
going to put a bullet in your head. Hey. I am going to put an end to this. Hey. And then we all can continue this drama in the afterlife. I will respect you. Take her, take her, take her. You can marry her, you can marry her. You can take her, please. Please. Now you want me to take her? What? As a corpse? Here sleeping. You know the prince and, and his people are making arrangements to come and see us today. And we are here sleeping. Making arrangement. Arrangement to do what? To come and see us now. You're supposed to be busy arranging things. Mama, that marriage cannot hold. Why? No, 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 no. That introduction cannot hold. Number one, I love Richard. I cannot marry any other man except him. Mm. Mama, secondly, I, I, I don't want the, the disaster I saw now to happen. And Mama, I had a dream. I, I, no, it's not a dream. It's a, it's a, because I didn't mean to sleep. I just finished threshing water and then I sat here to rest a little. Next thing, I went into a trance. Yes, it's a trance because I saw it clear. Mm. And Mama, the disaster I saw, is, it, it's horrible. It's horrible. We have to. You have. To, it cannot even happen. I told you. Josephine, you want to yourself or run, run. You are still dreaming at this eleventh hour, eh? Okay, okay. What what disaster are you talking about? Mama, Seth? I know what I'm saying. Mama, you not hear me now. I dreamt. It's not a dream. It's it's a disaster. It's a trance. Yes, I I saw where I was getting married to the prince. Let's see, Richard came there. He killed everybody. In fact, <laughs> he massacred everybody, including you, Mama. Hey. Including you. Hey, but Jesus. Why, it was horrible. Are you sure it's not your imagination? That's what imagination, Mama? You know me now. Please call them. Oh. Tell them not to come. Okay. Tell them. I think it's just your is imagination. It that is... Um... Is it true what I heard? Obi, what is it? What is it? Is what? it true that you're getting married? Y yes. Ah! Wait! Ah! Somebody's going to die today. Obi! Everybody is going to die. Obi, calm down. Nobody's dying. Calm down. I'm not getting married. Nothing is happening. What is going on? It's, it's, it's just the prince, the prince I saw in my dream. What does he want? I, I, I think there's a reason God brought him into my life. I'm supposed to help him. I think that's, that's what all Get him I call help Nothing him is going on. I'm not marrying him. It's you I'll marry. I'm not marrying any other person except you. That's what I want you to understand. And that's it. There's no marriage going on. No, just go home and rest. No, stop now. Stop now. You can't be doing this. No, stop now. Where are you taking me to? Where are you taking me to? Ije, this one you are hurrying out. I hope there's no problem. All is not well. All is not well at all. Since both of us are in the same problem, the prince has gone to whom we came for the marriage introduction. So, can you see it now? But the fact that we, we were not informed, it simply means that we are enemies. So what do we do now? I was warned in my dream by a strong spirit mm. that Roland is the chosen one. And whoever that is fighting him is fighting the gods. I don't want to die. So I'm going to the palace now.
to await his return and tender my apology. If that be the case, can I join you? You can join me. Enter the car. that his girlfriend is getting married to the prince. Gosh. I mean, what, what kind of stupid love is this? Kidnap him to a far away state and marry him there. Hmm. That's what I would do. Yes, that's what I'm going to do right away. You can't leave me. Is not going. Where is this guy? This is number five. Where's number six? Your father, the late king, killed a man and took a deal that belonged to the two of them. That was why he died an unnatural death and you cursed with epilepsy that comes once in a while. This said man had two children, a girl and a boy. Their names are Amaka and Chinonso, popularly known as Fast. Fast has always plotted to kill your wife on your wedding day. But your uncle has always beat him to it. What? What am I supposed to do? For I have just one week to present a bride to my people. That is why you have to hurry home, my king. For very important visitors await you. And who are these visitors? The visitors are Amaka and Chinonso. You don't have to be scared, my king, for the gods have ordained that Amaka will be your queen. She has the healing power that when you meet her as your wife, after your marriage, the epilepsy will be gone from you and it will be gone forever. My in-laws, you people have done well. Yes, eh? I'm happy. At this point, I hand you over to my brother to do the needful. Come to position, come here from Namo. Okay, there we go. That's it. But I'm done well. Bring my daughter. Hmm. Oh, wow. Hey, I don't know you.
ni Henny ni. Ah, jangan. Hey. Kali ada. Bekem. Ijele. Come my daughter. Today is that great and expected day. Hmm? Uh, Adabeke, <laughs> I want you to show me that man that has so stolen your heart that you no longer even concentrate on the, the basic <laughs> things. Uh, please, let me know who he is. Thank you. Yeah? Uh, <laughs> Ijere nwa Ewo Nuku ijere My great in law It shall be well with you. You shall have all the children you deserve. The type of children that will represent you properly everywhere. That with which you will train your children shall not be lacking in your house. You shall go and come in peacefully. Your children at the end of the day shall take care of you. Okay, do not man eke. Do not man ori. Do not man afo. Do not man ankwo. My people, I greet you all. <laughs> Today is indeed a very wonderful day. Ah, uh, we thank the gods for giving us the opportunity to witness this historical day. And so without wasting much of your time, I would like to do the needful. I would like to do the thing we are here to do. Thank you. Mm, the main thing. By the powers vested on me as the Onu of this kingdom, I hereby crown you the king of this our great kingdom. Your reign shall be peaceful. Your people, the subjects under you, they will all smile. And it shall be well with you. Long live the king!
patron cannot be left empty. I will choose another king from the bloodline. Who is he, my king? Kings are like stars, they rise and set. They have the worship of the world, but no repose. Kindness and faithfulness keeps the king safe. Hope like an ocean wave, great the fear of the grave, abound by faith and true love. The lame leap like a deer, the dead ones cannot hear, ransomed by your own blood. Where is the crown? Will you put down that gun? I give you 24 hours to provide that crown, else I will wreak havoc in your house. It's a promise. A man who dares to waste an hour of time has not discovered the value of life. We do not have time for riddles and arguments. Shoot him! Let the ritual begin. This is your throne. Are you ready to ascend it as the king of Uncle of your kingdom? The dead of a lion cannot be announced by a goat. Take my mind off you. I keep thinking about you. That is the most stupid thing I've ever had in my entire life. Protect my family with all you have got. I shall be back and I will wait for you.